I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a folk art turkey. I take two fingers over here on the left and I put a dot. And from that dot, I'm going to draw curve line, curve line down, curve line up, curve line over, and connect. I come right here at this point and I draw a curve line down, curve line up, connect. And right here at this point, I draw curve line down, up, connect. Right here, one dot right here, another dot. Okay. Now I come up and I'm going to draw a big curve line over and leave it floating. And I'm going to come down below and I'm going to draw a big curve line up and leave it floating. Because right here in the center, I'm going to put a dot. I'm going to draw a curve line out, up in connect. Now I can take this line and bring it down and this line and bring it up. Okay. Now starting on this point right here I draw a curve line over, up, connect. Down below I draw one curve line, two curve lines. Come back to the first one. Straight line, straight line, curve line out one, two, three, curve line out, one, two, three. Okay, I come all the way back up to the top and I'm going to draw a straight line, curve line, connect. Straight line, curve line, connect. Straight line, curve line, connect straight line, curve line, connect. One more if you have room. Straight line, curve line, connect. Okay. Um, right here, I'm just going to draw a curve line down, connect. Inside this first space, put a dot, curve line, curve line, connect. Put a dot, curve line, curve line, connect. Put a dot, curve line, curve line, connect, put a dot, curve line, curve line, connect. One more if you can squeeze it in, curve line, curve line, connect. Now I come to this section, and we're all going to have different amounts because we all draw differently. And I'm going to start and draw a wavy, wavy line one, wavy line two. Wavy line one, wavy line two. Wavy line one, wavy line two. Right here on this space, I draw a curve line. One, curve line, two. Curve line, 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 curve line, two. In this space down here, I'm going to draw a curve line, curve line, connect, and below I'm going to draw zig, zag, zig, zag, zig, zag, zig, zag, zig, zag, connect. I come all the way up here and I draw a straight line, curve line out, curve line out, baby circle, one, two, three, four, five curve lines. Come to the next one. Straight line, curve line, curve line, baby circle, one, two, three, four, and five. Come down, straight line, curve line, curve line, baby circle, one, two, three, four, five. Right here, little baby one, straight line, curve line, curve line, baby circle, 
one, two, three, four, five curved lines. One more, straight line, curve line out, curve line out, baby circle. One, two, three, four, five curve lines. Now I'm going to put a border on this so I come over here to the right and I just draw a wavy, wavy line down, leave it floating, come on the left. Wavy, wavy line down, leave it floating. Come over here, bottom, wavy line, connect, come up on the top, wavy line, connect. On this right hand side, I'm going to put baby circles all the way down. On the left, I'm going to put baby circles all the way down. I come back to the top and I'm just going to put straight diagonal, straight diagonal, straight diagonal to my corners and then fill in with straight lines going across. This is my border. If you don't want to do a border, you don't have to, but it finishes off your edges very nicely and it's part of the folk art turkey look that we're going for. Okay, all right, I think that's all. Let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, this is pretty intense, so if you want to, like I always say, you can draw in the first session and then color another day. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is color this space orange. I'm going to color all these baby circles orange. And when I have a project that's pretty intense like this in coloring, I like to go through each one of my crayons and just color those spaces I know are going to be that color. So I'm going to get all the spaces, I hope, done using my orange. Now up on top we're doing an ABAB pattern. So every other space is going to be orange for my border and come down here Every other space, A, B, A, B, should be orange on my border, okay? Now I'm using a lot of orange because that's turkey colors. So I am going to color around this space using my orange. And you may make your own decisions. These are the ones that I did. I'm going to come down and do this space, orange. I am going to color these spaces orange. You may use your own color scheme. These are the ones I chose. You are the artist. You can make your own choices. Keep going. This is what I mean. You might want to do it in two parts. All the way down and around. And I do my stripes on this space orange. Lots of orange. Whoops. Next, a lot of brown. So I'm going to color this space brown. And I'm going to do a loop de loop so it kind of looks like texture on this space is going to be brown. And this is the other part of my AB pattern. This up here is going to be brown. Okay, all the way. I'm going to color around my baby circles brown. So you can see I'm getting my big spaces of color out of the way. And then I'm going to come back in and do my little color de uh, details. But I want to get the big stuff out of the way first. So this takes a little bit of time, but when we finish you'll see oh it was well worth it so this is all brown okay I come and I do these spaces down here brown <clears throat> excuse me and I think that might be it we'll see next I'm taking my yellow green and I'm coloring these little spaces now we get to do the detail the fun part these are all 
yellow green and I do this part this space yellow green okay next I wanted to use some purple so I'm going to do my wavy wavy lines these are going to be purple and I'm going to do my zigzags in this space purple okay and I'm going to take my purple usually I do this at the end but since I have my purple color out you know we want to try and get our colors done as we do them I'm going to do the background of my square with a light loop-de-loop -loop purple you don't want to do it too dark because you don't want to lose all the detail on your turkey but you do want to get rid of that big white space for loop-de-loop -loop purple okay let's see if I've done all that next I'm going to take my yellow and do in between my wavy wavy lines I'm going to do these spaces by my zigzags yellow and all of my centers baby circles here I'm going to do these yellow next I'm going to take my regular green and just do these spaces regular green and last but not least my red this is to do my turkey waddle gobble gobble and to do these spaces up here and I cannot tell you more that a good idea would be to do session one drawing session two coloring because you want to take your time and you want it to look nice okay let's see what this looks like all colored in okay here is my folk art turkey all colored in ready for Thanksgiving okay bye bye